What is your opinion on Anki cards covering missed questions in QBank? Um, I don't think you should make Anki from QBank. Like even our QBank, like I don't think you should do that. Like I don't think it's a good use of time. Because th and and I'll I'll give you a reason. Okay, um, when you make Anki, it's overrated the process of actually making the Anki itself. Like it's not going to help you remember more. And then like you reviewing later is like you essentially doing a form of question. And it's like if you're going to like do a form of question, just do like more actual questions, not like Anki, like from QBank. You know what I'm saying? Just like. Um, recognize that it's normal to forget things as you go through QBank. It's normal. You're not trying to remember 95% of what you read. Like you might retain 25%, but if it's high yield, it's going to show up again. Like if you do Melman QBank, you're going to see like, I don't know, you're going to see more than one question on cystic fibrosis. You're going to see more than one question on von Willebrand disease. So like, because those are high yield. So don't worry about like memorizing every little thing because if it's high yield, it's going to show up again. 